for all those cats that I was ballin' with Say rap ain't finna get my ass a scholarship And how come every teacher's motto is Music ain't gon' do for you what college shit for me That's the problem there, see baby, I ain't you on me Tonight I'm gonna party with the people that believe and we get our first chance to see Zach Wilson, the junior quarterback. He has made a leap from last year to this year that reminds you of what Joe Burrow did from 2018 to 2019 at LSU. It really does. I mean, he's kind of come out of nowhere, and a lot of the reason for that is he's healthy. He's recovered from a shoulder injury, recovered from a thumb injury, and you see that 11 touchdowns responsible for. He also only has 11 incompletions through the first three weeks. 11 touchdowns and 11 incompletions. Remarkable. And on first down, he goes out of the backfield to Gunnar Romney, who's got three straight 100-yard games and a first down pickup for Romney. 24 out of 26 last week. Two for two today. Dax Milne deep into UTSA territory. The most impressive part about his high completion percentage He's not dinking and dunking on no. bubble screens. He's throwing it downfield. Yeah, this is a great navigation of the pocket. Back to the air. Wilson has Neil Pau. He lost the football. It's on the ground. And did he recover or does UTSA have it? And the Roadrunners take it away early. And play action could be in play now for BYU. Wilson gets rid of it quickly and he's got Isaac Rex. His big tight end, he is four for four on the season. Still only 11 incompletions all year. And that's Carter Wheat, another tight end. Big number 96, rumbling for a big game. 100 yards already, less than six minutes into the game. Wilson pumps, steps up, buys time, and a rare incompletion as How he tried to he? shovel it to an open <laughs> Carter Wheat. Algier motions out. Screen pass goes to Tyler Algier. Little stutter step, and he's going to be well shy of the marker, driven out by a horde of road runners. Wilson backpedaling, chased, throws on the run, downfield, incomplete. Zach Wilson steps up, shovels it ahead. <laughs> You said it earlier, I not me. You. That's Mason Wake. You said he's got a little Mahomes in him. We saw it there. He just finds ways to get rid of the football. Sometimes it's sidearm. Sometimes it's a shovel. Sometimes it's over the top. It all depends on what's going on around him. He's got tremendous instincts for the pocket. Dangerous throw. And over the head of Carter. Wait, three incompletions in the first quarter with Zach Wilson. Boy, stock dropping. Tunnel screen. Romney. And into Roadrunner territory, second down. That is Neil Powu inside the 40. 16 of 19 in the red zone this year, 13 touchdowns. Wilson being chased by Hicks on the run and still picks up positive yards, and that's going to be a horse collar on Trevor Harmonson. I told him he looked like Bane. From Batman when we saw him the other day. Second and goal for BYU out of an empty set. And a strike to Dax Milne. That is Zach Wilson's roommate. Those guys played at rival high schools. They go back a long way. Here's Romney. And he is stood up. Fourth down coming up for BYU. Something to remember. Wilson flushed. Floats it back in the end zone. Pau, did he stay in bounds? And it is a touchdown for Neil Pau. Screen pass to Algier, nearly intercepted. We just saw on third and short, Mason Wake, 6'1", 250, pick up the first down. Wilson, eluding the pursuit, flag down. It's incomplete. You thought Dicker the kicker could maybe do it again. Second and 16, and that is off the hands of uh, Braden Cosper, the sophomore. Milne <laughs> and is bumped out of bounds midair by Corey Mayfield, Jr. Wilson pumps. <laughs> there is Katoa into the end zone with ease. 
I'll let you say it, because you said it earlier. Did you see how he got the ball out? It's just this subtle little nuance. Watch it. It might not always be pretty, but look how he had to get it out. See his elbow? The, this is the only way he makes the throw. He can't throw that over the top. Wide open, Milne. Steps out of bounds, is a first down. Yeah, Narcisse, another running quarterback. Zach Wilson fooled the defense, and he has dropped. It's working in that league. Yeah. Another rare incompletion by Wilson. Only had 11 on the season coming into today. That's his fifth of the first half. Uh, another check down, that's Isaac Rex. Isaac's dad, a former All-American tight end at BYU Byron. There's a shot downfield. Whoa. And he puts it right in the bread basket of Romney, who cannot hold on. Against a three-man rush, now delayed pressure. And this is Neil Pau, who has a touchdown in this game. Third down. Four-man rush. High throw brought in by Milne. Got away from Parks momentarily, but still shy of the marker. Wilson flushed again on first down. He'll run and picks up a yard. Cougars need the 20. Wilson gets rid of it quickly. And there is Dax Milne. Wilson at Corner Canyon, which is now the preeminent power in the state of Utah. Used to be Bingham. Downfield. Gunnar Romney makes the catch. And if he got away from Tariq Woolen, it wouldn't have been a touchdown. It might be undercut by the defender by bringing him across the field. He could have even done a little bit more, gave him a chance. Wilson, who has five rushing touchdowns using his feet. And it's first and goal after a run of 13. Pau lined up in the slot. There's the quarterback run. And Wilson with his sixth rushing touchdown of the season. You called it, Anish. This is the area they love the quarterback run. Today and all season, Wilson has time. Dancing on the run, low throw for Algier. It's incomplete. Second and eight after a two-yard gain. Wilson, and that's Dax Milne, who's, again, always wide open. You see guys wearing 1 2 0, 2 1 0, really, for UTSA. Those are the tough guys. Part of the triangle of toughness. Pau, and he is blown up. There's pressure. Wilson off his back foot. Wants Milne. Who else? A young man who says, I play for my mom. That's my why. He's as tough as nails. He gets that from his mother, who beat stage four cancer. to the air. Wilson is hit and nearly intercepted. Tyler Monkey almost had it, second and 10. This is the first true risk that was a bad decision I've seen from Zach Wilson today. Now